Shalom, shalom. Give it all praises, all glory, all honor to Yahweh, God, Shem, God, Shem, God, Shem, God, God, All right, noble honors to our apostles and our elders and great millstone who are well. All right, and peace and salutations to all you all came out there preaching this truth with uh, throughout the four corners of the earth. The truth is sincerity in your hearts. All right, this is GMS Indiana, Gary Indiana Camp, coming at you again with the uh, prophesying the downfall of America, man. You know, and, and, and Bible and biblical prophecy. And the first biblical prophecy is that men of the Lord are out here standing upon their watch, you know, telling you people what's to come, whether you hear, whether you forbear, you know, and that's our job. That's one of our responsibilities of being a prophet of the Lord, man. You know, could you start with that? This number 10, verse 9. God, because it's going back to the beginning, man. Nothing new is under the sun. It's always been watched. The Lord has always set upon himself watchmen. Whether you call him a watchman, a prophet, a seer, it's all the same thing, you know? That's right. There's Numbers 10 and 9. It says, if you go, I mean, so like, if ye go to war in your land against the enemy that oppress you, then ye shall blow an alarm with the trumpet. God, if ye shall go, uh, uh, in a, it's like, read that again from the top. There's Numbers 10 and 9. It says, and if, Ye go to war in your land against the enemy that oppress you. So we, if we go to war with the enemy in our land that oppressed us, this ain't our land, but we at we war with these people that are oppressing us, man. Starting with these elites, the elite banking families, man. The so-called uh, so white men, man, the Edomites. You know, we at war with them, but we not at war like you think. All right, we, we, rest, we wrestle not with, uh, with flesh and blood, but against principalities, against spiritual wickedness, man. We at war through the spirit with these people. All right, so what are we supposed to do? They say, then ye shall blow an, an alarm with the trumpets. Then we shall blow an alarm with the trumpets. Now this is, and when this was written, this is speaking literally. All right, but now we're in a spiritual time. So we got to do the same thing spiritually, you know? Isaiah 58, 1 says, cry ye aloud, spare not, lift up thy voice like a trumpet, man. We blowing that alarm, you know? We letting you people know that the, uh, the downfall of this place is coming. Whether you care, whether you don't care, it don't matter to us, man, because we do what the Lord told us to do. God, you got it. This is Isaiah 52 and 8. Thy watchman, excuse me, thy watchman shall lift up the voice, excuse me, thy watchman shall lift up the voice. With the voice together shall they sing, for they shall see eye to eye when your house shall bring again Zion. Ooh, shall bring again Zion, man. That's bringing in uh, the northern and the southern kingdom together, man. He's bringing, the, he's bringing in the whole fold. We're going to sing this song. This song is the correct doctrine, man. That's the thing we're, we're both singing, northern and southern kingdom, man. We're not singing opposite poles anymore. We're coming together with the same song, the same song that Moses sung to the children of Israel when they came out of the, uh, the wilderness, man. You know? You got something to say? Uh, yeah, so the, the, the purpose of this is like Zephaniah 3 and 9 says. Uh, lift up, uh, we're going to have one accord. We're going to be on one accord. We're right. going to be a, a pure language, yep. one accord, calling on the same name, yep. because the scripture tells you there's only one name you can be saved by, and, and the whole thing. So, you know, it isn't going to be a bunch of strife and, 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 and camp, camp mixing and shit. Yep. And, and, and this, that, and other. That can't go because how you gonna be calling, you can call him anything, and I'm saying that his name is Yahweh Shah, yep. and we be on the same accord. Yep. So, no. Hey, so, because yeah. when you go into the history of it, man, when you read the book of, uh, because when you, read, when you read the Bible and understand it, the prophets was in the time of the first kings and second kings, man. They were in the times of when when uh, when Israel was going off. Because Israel went off, it tells you in the book of uh, Hosea, that Israel went off first. All right. When you read First Kings, it tell you that Israel went off first, man. But well, who's the king of who's the king of Israel? Rehoboam. Rehoboam was the king of Israel. He went off first, man. Judah was still righteous, man. The king of Judah was still righteous. So Israel went off first. So at, at a time, we were preaching different doctrines. You know what I'm saying? But the pops, uh, the, the scripture pops is brought out, man. The Lord is going to bring together Zion and preach one doctrine, man. That's the time of right now. Watch me, so cry loud, man. Uh, lift up that voice like a trumpet. We're in that time right now. You know? Yeah, it say, uh, I believe, what, in Revelation or Ezekiel, I, 
uh, it's one of the books. They say the two sticks shall speak. Yeah, Ezekiel. And, yeah, Ezekiel, man. And the two sticks is, is rising up right. and, and coming together, man. He's bringing our nation back, man. I'm gonna finish this number ten and nine. They say if you go to to war in your land against the enemy that oppress you, then you shall blow an alarm with the trumpets, and you shall be a rememberer for the Lord your power, and you shall be saved from your enemies, man. You shall be remembered, man. So the Lord gonna remember us if we come if we come out here and stand upon our watch, all right, and, and blow that trumpet, which is that alarm, which that alarm means to alert. People, alarm means to an alert, alert the people that what's to come. If we do that, then the Lord is going to remember us. But if you don't do that, you know, then the sword is coming for you, man. All right. You got anything else? Oh, I don't think so. Go ahead. There's Jeremiah 4 and 19. It say, my bowels, my bowels. I am pain at my very heart. My heart made a noise in me. I cannot hold my peace. Mm. Because they have heard of my soul, the sound of the trumpet, the alarm of war. <laughs> and that's that spiritually. <laughs> that's a perfect precept because that's spiritually, man. Yeah. You know? Hey, I'm against you people, man. They have heard the sounds of my bowels, man. As Jeremiah said, this word was in my bones as a fire, man. That's right. They have heard the fire in my heart. These people are hearing the fire of our heart, man. And we at war with you people, man. You know why? Because you don't agree with these holy scriptures. That's why we at war, man. You have heard the sounds of our bowels. You know? As they, what, the, what they say, my bowels, I'm spilling my guts to you, motherfucker. Know, exactly. <laughs> Jake, man, Jake got sayings, man, that, 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 par that paraphrase with these scriptures, man, because that's how you know that we're children of the power, man. That's it. But I spilled my guts trying to get you to understand this. And, and you didn't want to hear. That's right. You, you wasn't feeling it, man. You wasn't feeling it. You wasn't feeling it. <laughs> that's, that's another thing. Somebody, I got a little more. Okay. Verse 20, it say, destruction upon destruction is cried. For the whole land is spoiled. Suddenly are my tents spoiled and my curtains in a moment. How long shall I see the standard and hear the sound of the trumpet? And then go into uh, verse 22. For my people is foolish. They have not known me. They are solid children. Stupid. Uh-huh. And they have, have no understanding. They are wise to do evil. But to do good, they have no knowledge, man. Now they, know how, they, 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 know how, they know how to take motherfucking baking soda mm -hmm. and powder yeah. and mix that shit up and make rock. They know how to they know how to do credit card scam, forgery, all kinds of shit. Identity theft. Bitches know how to go. Uh, Cardi B just said she know how to take a motherfucker and drug his ass out and let some trainees run up in them, have them all fucked up. All this they know how to do all this shit. They know what they 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 strive to do all of this shit. They, they lay on their bed the same way that Edom might lay on his bed and come up wicked ways to do shit. That's right. Uh, that's people right. lay on their bed and come up wicked ways to get at each other. That's yeah. right, man. And how can I sell this crack, man, in a way that nobody has ever done on the face of the earth, man? How can I sell that? I'm going to do it with children. Because they, they the cops don't suspect children. I'm going to make mules for myself and have them sell it. And them my lookouts, man. You start with Pablo Escobar, man. You see, you see that in Narcos. That's and our people took that and ran with it. We got brothers in the truth that has personal testimonies of them selling crack before they was 10 years old, man. You know? So, oh, man. Read, read that over again. <laughs> read that over again. <laughs> this Jeremiah 4 and 19. It say, my bowels, my bowels, I'm at pain at my very heart. Mm -hmm. My heart made a noise in me. I cannot hold my peace. That word heart goes into love, man. My mind. Your mind. My mind was crying out to me. It was like, go tell these dumb motherfuckers what's going on. Man, you, you got to. First of all, it's going to be on your spirit if you don't. Yep. And, and I'm going to hold you responsible if you don't. Yep. So he's like, man, you know, that, that, that's like when you do something wrong and, and your, your spirit convicts your ass. You got to go, go get right, dog. That's right. <laughs> go ahead, uh. I say, because they have heard of my soul, and the sound of the trumpet, the alarm of war. Right. Destruction upon destruction is cried. So we standing out here telling you, y'all have no clue as to the destruction that's coming down the pipe. Y'all can't even fathom it. Time of Jacob's trouble. Worst time that you ever seen. This is what we trying to get you to understand and get you to, to be able to wrap your mind around and be able to understand. We're we, we not telling you some stuff 
just for the for the sake of it. We telling you some stuff because the Bible says it. If y'all say y'all believe the Bible, then you should understand when the Lord says that he's getting ready to show you something to do, something that you ain't never seen before. It ain't never been this bad before. And y'all done been through some bad shit. That's right. They say, for the whole land is spoil you. Sudden are my tents spoil you and my curse in a moment. How long shall I see the standard and hear the sound of the trumpet? For my people is foolish. They have not known me. They are sottish children, and they have none understanding. He said, how long would I see the standard? How long am I going to hear the standard? My prophets are out here speaking as truth. How long, how long do you think I'm going to sit back here and let them be out there and let their word be in vain? It's not. Why? Because my, I said my word will not come back for it. They out there pushing my word. So time is running out on you, motherfucker. That's right. You ain't understanding this. When my word get, got out to the four corners of the earth, that was the end of the story. Right. So now everybody's going to borrow motherfucking time. Okay? They right. say, they are wise to do evil, but to do good, they have no knowledge. And, and that's what we were saying. I was trying to uh, uh, explain this to somebody a, a little while back. You all, our people always want to try to set their own righteousness. Yep. They want to set their own way that the Lord is going to say, supposed to forgive them and save them. He said, no, I gave yep. you the blueprint as to what you have to do and what you, what's going to be my people and what they're going to be doing in those days. If you if you one of those people that looking to be saved, you going to make your shit line up with them. Right. If you not, then your, sentence, your ass is set for destruction. Hey, how y'all doing? All right, man. What's going on? No, I was talking to him, but he already know what I was talking about. And he never done it. They don't want you in the picture. What you mean? You remember when I told you about Blase, Blase, and you forgot about it? I guess I did. But what the brother just said, man, he said that these people have a, their own way of righteousness. These people got their own way of righteousness. No, hey, I, hey. Gave, I gave you a scripture in that. He never done it. <laughs> what's, hey, the what's the scripture? What's the scripture? What's the scripture? Huh? What's, what's the, the scripture? scripture you gave him? What's the scripture? I gave him Revolution 1. Revelation 1. 1. Uh huh. What's the scripture? Revelation 1. No, no. Put it up there. Uh huh. We, we pull, he pulled it up now. Revelation 1 and what? 23. And he never put it up there. There is no Revelation 1 and 23. So, so. No, no. What's the other one in Revelation? I don't oh, know. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, I'm, I'm not talking to him. No, what you, what's what the you context? Mean? When you're talking to me, you're talking to them. There ain't no more. There ain't no What's the gist of the uh, scripture? So what is you, try, what what is you, you trying, trying to figure out? What, what man, what's the other one? Word, 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 word it, man, because like I said, you, you obviously you can't call out what the scripture is. Yes, talking. I can't, because I grew up in church. Oh, well, you, you didn't call the right one, so okay. what is it? It's all right, man. Word it, man, word it. What is it, what is it, what is it? No, no, no. I told him to say James. Two and twenty-three, and he never done. It. All right, thank you. And I told him about it, and it's up in there. All right, if you told me about it, man, I apologize, man, because I don't remember. Just like how you don't remember. Yeah, you. Oh no. Hey, wait, 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 wait. You just walked up and said revelation, man. Wait, wait. Revolution. It shows, it shows you how important the scripture was to you because you don't remember. And I apologize for me. I remember. I don't remember the scripture. Okay. Isaiah two. You quote two of the twenty threes, and you done went through three, three different books. Hey, bro, have yeah. some have some respect. You interrupted us. Ah, uh, no, no. It's you interrupted my lane. Then keep going, man. You interrupted. Excuse us. my lane. If you All really right. want to know a scripture, man, then I ask. say excuse my lane. All right. Thanks to you, later, uh, bro. Come on, man. Go All right. Back to the lesson, man. Back, back to the, the lesson, lesson, man. <laughs> but I was going to get Proverbs. The brother said, "Our people have a, their own way of expressing their own righteousness, man." This is Proverbs chapter 16, verse 25. There is a way that seemeth right unto a man, but the end thereof are the ways of death. And that's what these people think, man. Oh, I, I'm, I'm doing right. I give back to my community. Oh, I'm seeking righteousness by helping the kids in my community. 
by, by going to soup kitchens and feeding the homeless. Right. That's their way of doing the, the ways of God. That's their way of doing the ways of God, man. All right? They, but the they, end they, they, thereof, the ways of death, because you ain't you, you might go to them, school, them soup kitchens and feeding your people pork. That's right. your righteousness, man. You ain't going by the way the Heavenly Father set it out, man. The scriptures say, I will give you passes according to my heart that shall feed you with knowledge and understanding, man. Right? Like, like, the, like uh, when we were down there, we used to be on the state in Van Buren. Uh -huh. They used to come down there and feed them motherfuckers ham sandwiches. Hot dogs. That's what they do. You know, so, so, so I'm saying. So, so all this motherfucking pork that you pumping in their stomach, and they be like, "I'm doing good. I'm giving back to the community. I'm helping the needy." No, right. you're not, man. You hurting them. You, you causing them to commit sin. That's oh, yeah. right. Preach up on this. This Jeremiah 13 and 23. Can the Ethiopian change his skin, or the leopard his spots? God. Then may ye also do good that are consumed to do evil, man. <laughs> and that's what they do, man. Yeah. Hey, 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 giving them that, that Sue's kissing. Hey, hey, it seems like it's a good thing because they feeding the people, but you misleading them, man. You feed them, You're not you feeding feed them the good things right. of the law. And that's why the, the Lord said, man, don't lean onto your own understanding, man. Right. God. It ain't, it ain't hard to, like Ben Scroy always say, man, it ain't hard to stop eating pork, man. It ain't hard to stop getting the line. And you ain't gotta be no prophet, man. You ain't gotta come in on the, on the highways and byways and preach the downfall of America, man. You can just follow the laws and sincerity and truth, man, and the Lord might save you, man. Right. Not everybody is a prophet. Right. It ain't hard to keep these laws, but it's hard for somebody who want to do wickedness, man. It's hard for you because you wise to do evil, man. And the Lord gonna have your ass for that. You know? Proverbs 3. Proverbs 5. God, Proverbs 3 and 5. Trust in the Lord with all thy heart and lean not into thy own understanding. And that's the key, man. It say trust yeah. in the Lord and all you thy heart, man. Five. And all you believe in your mind and everything that you do, man. And lean not onto your own understanding, man. Because when you are uh, thinking you you doing good or lining yourself up, hey, that's composition of the scriptures, man. And hey, we supposed to keep the law. We supposed to eat right. Ain't nothing wrong with those things, man. When you go about your own righteousness, trying to establish your own righteous eating pork, that's going off, man. Hey, you read verse six, Bible Proverbs. Come. Yeah, Proverbs five and six. It's Proverbs uh, uh, three and verse six. Three and six. Oh. Proverbs 3 and 6. And all thine way. You want, I read it again. You got a point? I read it again. No. It's Proverbs 3 and 5. Trust in the Lord with all thy heart and lean not unto thy own understanding. Mm -hmm. And all thine ways acknowledge him and he shall direct thine paths. Right. And all thy ways, man. The Lord's going to uh, direct your paths, man. Not establish your own ways, man. You got to trust in the Lord that he's going to die and give you the way to uh, be in righteousness, man. Keep going. One more verse. I'm Bible shop how you can have it. You study. Verse 7. Verse 7. Proverbs 3 and 7. Be not wise in thine own eyes. Don't be wise in your own eyes, in your own mind, and what you think. Keep going. Be not wise in thine own eyes. Fear the Lord and depart from evil. And that's the key. You have to fear the Lord, man. A lot of these people don't have the fear of the Lord out here, man. They don't have the spirit of fear. Because if they did, they would do right. That would be the beginning of wisdom. That's the beginning of wisdom, man. Right. They would keep the law. They would get this knowledge. But they don't fear the Lord, man. And they not. They don't want to depart of evil. I mean, don't depart away from evil, man. They go into evil, man. We just said they saw the children. They was to do evil, man. And that's the, that, that's the first step is fear, man. Because when you fear, hey, you're going to do what's right. Yep. You got it. You got it. Genesis. Genesis. Genesis chapter 6, verse 5. And God saw the wickedness of man was great in the earth, and that every imagination of the thoughts of his heart was, was only evil continually. So this was before the flood, but... These same spirits are back now. And they still think that they, they can do right, think they're getting it right, and the whole deal. But with every 
But with everything being what it is, need it again. God. Genesis 5, uh, 6 and 5. And Yahweh saw the wickedness of man was great in the earth, and that every imagination of the thoughts. <laughs> <laughs>